Good evening and welcome back to Astro Economy as I just drop things apparently onto my um, drip pad and do with things stuff. Good evening and welcome back to Astro Economy. Um, we are just basically waiting for science to come along and do its thing. Have a fun. Have a fun. Um, that isn't exactly working properly uh, for a couple of reasons. Um, one, these are not getting enough goods coming in quickly enough we're making enough of them we're making enough everything's fine for them. everything's we're fine the problem is is that um like carbon fiber for instance the carbon fiber comes down the pipe comes along ends up in here and when this has more than one this turns off and says nope we don't want any more we don't want any more so what i feel we need to do is let this all empty Turn off all these guys here so they can't output the goods and then turn it all back on again and see how many we get of each type in here and then we can say hey if you're below that amount then you need to request more because that means that's how many you get uh before this system turns off so if it, if it goes to like if it goes to one um uh and uh it's actually got 15 in there we need to say if you're lower than 15 you actually need to send more because by the time it gets down here that's how long it takes so how do we do that how do we do that well the easiest way is going to be uh, if i cut this power up this uh data cable here does that just turn off the data nope apparently that uh that doesn't that just leaves them all open hmm okay Okay, I was expecting that to um to disable the whole thing, not not um let it carry on flowing, but mm. it also means because this uh this this is also very saturated. It's very saturated. It's not stuff not coming through fast enough. So, and there is no faster belts. There's no faster um uh, oh there is an expert. There is there is there is a fast one, isn't there? Here, which requires twenty five thousand engineering science, and we have three thousand, so we can't do that. Um, so. I think I need to just turn these all off if I can. I need to tell them to like stop doing the thing because this is just permanently going because it's got um it's looking for one. Uh, it's not actually getting any. I don't think it can output anything. I think that's the problem. I think you can't output anything because the, the thing yeah, it's got sixteen thousand nine bars and it just can't output it because the stuff is um uh it just it's just the belt the the line the line is just completely saturated so how we need to fix that we need to fix that we need to <clears throat> maybe slow down the outputs because at the moment it's just letting the stuff from there not that we need uh, well we do need a general science that's that's the kind of the important one we need so so this is stopped here this is stopped here i think this is stopped because this is lower than the threshold of actual things it's still requesting them because it's requesting them all the time um maybe i need to have a pipe for each individual one one two three four five six seven eight nine ten pipes coming down here I mean, that would only work if these were in the correct order of the distance. So, so like, this is right. The uh, uh, that would go up and over and join. That would. It'd have to go like. Dirt would have to be the first one. I guess. Uh, whatever happens i need to stop this i need to, i need this this all needs to stop this all needs to stop um so can we no, 
I don't need slits in that. No, 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 no. Can we just, um... Cut off these and let this all filter and uh, empty out and uh, <clears throat> drain down. And then we can figure stuff out once it's done because it isn't working and it's just clogging stuff up. It's not doing anything. If I want to do individual lines, then that's fine. We can do individual lines. But in order to do individual lines, I would need... To run the basically needs to come up and come on because they can't be next to each other they've got to be um uh, they're gonna be like one apart they can't be next to each other all they touch and that that doesn't they, they merge together so that doesn't work um so we can't do that so i'm gonna let that filter down and empty out this here because it's still got to empty out all the uh like everything that's stored in these things here it's got to empty all these things out so um mm. I'm going to take you out there. I'm going to put you back in there because you do not need 16,000 stuff coming down here. Uh, and what we're going to do is we're also going to come over here and fix this because this is broken. <coughs> this is, um, we're empty of water, so we need to fix that. Uh, so I want to basically copy this and flip it, but I don't know if you can flip blueprints. Let us find out. Let us find out if you can flip a blueprint. So let's come here. Grab... This here. Uh, I need to actually come over like two more as well. Okay. We can sort these things out on the line. Uh, select, make a blueprint, add the blueprint. Um, is there a. Um, <clears throat> There's a rotate, so we can rotate it round. So, hmm, nah. Oh, uh, new blueprint. Uh, what the Get rid of the floor. Also, get rid of that belt. Okay, and then we will paste that in oh I'm inside the building right see I don't that's not what I want that's not what I want um yeah you, you can't flip it because you can't flip buildings so it does kind of have to go there that's the awkward thing about it it does kind of have to go there if I want to get it actual opposite of this thing here it's got to live there like that because the inputs are on this side and the outputs are on that side, so that's just how it's going to go. Um, oh, they all plug into the, uh, the stuff on their own. There you go. Um, <clears throat> yeah, because the inputs are on the side. Let's not flip them round. But... I don't think we need to do that. I think we need to um, grab Nope. Nope, you know what? I am going to I am gonna I'm gonna adjust these completely. Yep. Yep, we're gonna adjust these completely. So um, we're gonna take out all of this. I'll replace the belts in the center in a moment. You just uh boom 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 boom. Uh that's all three. <coughs> oh yeah, flooring. Dope. <laughs> that's okay.
what we'll do instead of this you bet um, is we will have the uh ice breakers which are utilities yep we'll have them facing this way I have to be two apart. Hmm. Love that. We uh, <clears throat> will have to have this come out to here. It'll go this way. It'll split. Like that. And then we'll just have a splitter there. Cool. Okay. So let's grab another. Uh, box selection tool and we'll do this Doop. edit that don't set the floor we don't need the floor select all make a blueprint out of it yep come to this blueprint get rid of this because this is going to be in the way delete Okay, and then I can, if I'm ready, build this blueprint again. Um, uh, oh, page up doesn't do that. Ah. Um, <clears throat> right, so put it in this way around as well, and it should just connect. There like that. There we go. Boom. Now let's put one on top. How do we get it on top? Uh, we have to just build up on top of this. So let's go with... Um, from what I should have done really is put the power lines and stuff in as well. That would have probably helped. Oh dear. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I don't know. Uh, that button. by two we're just gonna run the pad directly up like this i'm trying to get it so that it splits the ice more evenly yep okay um so let's go back into the blueprint for this guy then um let's uh first and foremost let's rotate it round move it across move it forward there right okay kind of awkward I probably want to move it down by one but yeah uh, so we go one two three okay yeah okay right so now we need to do is uh, have it so that it connects to I don't think you can connect to that one directly can you do, 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 do that one Nope, can't see on top of that one. Needs to go up one further than that. That's a little awkward <clears throat> because that means. Uh... Hmm. Why can't you sit there? Hmm. What's wrong with that? Is it the power lines? Oh, I've gone up way too far on the power lines. Hold on.
Yeah, and then we just grab uh, this. And, uh, uh, well, we need to take that one back. Take that one back. This will have to come along and uh, put up. And this one will have to come along and I assume go up by two. Let's go down one further than that. Okay, so um well, that, that's the correct place for it, but I need to actually put in a uh let me let me, let me delete that one there. Come up by one and go down the one because I'm using the uh actual uh, yep, and then take out the power lines because the power lines are incorrect. That will fit there. Let me just remove these two and replace that one with a black. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Okay. So that'll feed all them. Not that it did actually go up on those ones there, so this could have come in flat and gone into them, but that's just the way we're going to do it. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Okay, so if I actually go and edit that blueprint again and actually do drop it down by one, it's going to make life so much easier for us. Um, so yeah, um, so I can just do that and that, and then I should just be able to grab the blueprint, place it. Uh, oh no, nope. I need to move it uh, away from. Get rid of those two. Blueprint. One there. And then get rid of the uh, power lines, which are still messed up. That took a lot more effort than I want because I, I messed the blueprint up. I messed the blueprint up. That's the problem. Oop, there you go. Okay. And then we just get spitters. Down. Oh, rotate. Uh, we go spitter, 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 a spitter. Splitter, splitter. Go one, two, and three. And there it goes. Can you see that slightly pausing then? So it goes, it goes right, pause left, right, pause left, right, pause. That's that's because of the zero in the center. That's because the um. I'm, I am I am convinced it is actually slower if I do not put the zero in there. I probably am wrong and it's a placebo thing, but I'm I am so convinced of it I'm gonna add them in. So simple as that. There we go. Right. Boom. Uh, get rid of that power line there. Uh, eight. Boom, like that. And then run the power line through like that. There we go. They should all now start producing the waters. Which would be very nice, which will start filling that up there. But I'm going to go back into here. And I'm going to grab the ice that we have. Merge it all together. And then I'm going to... Uh, split it uh, three ways. So 1, 8, 2, 4, 5, 3 divided by 3 is... Uh, 60,000. 60,000. And then that one. You may have 60,000 ice there. You may have 60,000 ice there. You may have 62,000 ice there. Congratulations. You're also going to get these ones because I'm too lazy to put them in other ones. Well done. There you go. Awesome. Now you're going to output your ice at the absolutely phenomenal rate that you are. And then all the ice makers should get stuff in them. Some of them might suffer a little bit, but who knows? Who knows? And hopefully our uh, main... grid is now finished if that makes sense so yeah, hopefully this will start filling up i'm not really sure i think i, I think it's um 
this may not even be enough for what we're using at the moment, but I think a lot of stuff is starving right now, so it probably needs to fill, fill up everything over there first. Well, it, it's consuming them. Once it once it's once the consumption's done, um, maybe these tanks will start filling. We will see. Um, they are definitely getting more in than they can actually handle, so that's still good. They're still even splitting them technically six ways now. Um, they're still not actually running fast enough to uh, consume all the ice that's in there. So, okay. So now that's done. So right, this pipe is still moving uh, dirt because I told it not to. Uh, uh, still moving dirt and rods. God. How much is in here? Stop. 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 Okay. Okay. And then we'll tell this to stop moving. Uh, dirt as well get out of there go in there okay oh, okay okay right so that'll empty out there so what i think i want to do is i need to adjust these to be um the order of that they're coming out it so this one's iron so the first one that comes up is going to be iron So it'll come along. It can't, it can't really do that because this, we've got all this here. Um, so maybe I have to come up above it and we'll start going above it. And then we'll just go up and over and into it. So so this, this will come up and the arm will go into there. The next one will come up and it will be... Um, and it's going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be going like 10 high, isn't it? Yeah, it's going to be like 10 high. I can't do anything about it. Well, it's going to be 20 high because I can't um, do it. We can um, uh, do uh, that with them. Um, that, that That is a valid way of stacking them. So we can make it 10 high um, by doing it that way. I think that's what we'll do. What's happening here? There's loads of copper bars in there. It's got the copper bars. There you go. Right, so that's empty now. Okay. Because this is not working. This is not working. So, so we need to redo this. We need to redo this. Okay, and that's fine. That's fine. We will redo this. Right. So, I can't do it staggered. I, can't, well, I can do it staggered if I make sure that none of them ever meet each other. What have we got running under the ground here? Nothing. Okay, we're going to go under. We're going to go under instead. Could go up above. That would still work. But if, if I went under, I could do a 10 wide under the fair. And there's plenty of space to do it. And on top, we could do 10 wide above them. But I'm not really a fan of that. So like the, the iron would come up, would come along, go into its thing. The next one would come up um, and would come along. So basically, dirt would be the first one. I would be the second. Yeah, so this would be dirt. This will be reading dirt. And you're outputting all of the... That's fine, just output all the stuff you got. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Um, uh, then we're going to go with uh, iron. iron. Then we're going to go with copper. Then what's next on the list? We have rods and O2. I'm not gonna go too far because if I go too far ahead, my brain will fail and I'll have to be doubling back going, what's this one, what's that one, what's the other one? That rods and O2 and you are gonna be doing rods. Thank you. And your O2, so your O2, so that's all fine. Awesome, right. Um, then we've got after O2, we've got after O2, we have gears and motherboards. Zoom. Gears. 
is is uh, is you can let all the stuff out that's fine uh, and then this is going to be motherboards Oop. and no nope, that's trees Oop. motherboards there you go and we've got three left really wait uh what have we got we got stone plates polymer and graphite stone plates graphite and polymer in that order stone plates graphite and polymer Stone plates, graphite, polymer. Probably graphene, not graphite, but stone plates, carbon fiber, it's not even graphene, carbon fiber, and polymer. You're letting all your copper out. You're letting this, this take all the stuff out of this because it's not going to work. Okay. And then what I'll do is I actually want to steal the um, outputs from there. Okay. I want to steal the outputs from there. So yeah. Boom. Um, and then this isn't needed. This has never been required. So I don't need to fail safe. It's fine. Uh, can I put in uh, actually no and this shouldn't even matter now I shouldn't even need the filters here if I'm honest I'm going to need the filters in there but we shouldn't need them All this zoom 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 and yep you guessed it whoosh ah caught you out there didn't i ah ah see pushing on buttons pushing on buttons i've said it before and i'm going to say it again but the sound effects are important you have to make the sound effects otherwise it won't work it won't work. Bob Ross taught me that. If you don't make the weird sound effects, then, you know, it doesn't work. It just doesn't work. So, and Bob knows best. So, yeah. Okay. Oh, and uh, I didn't realise the, um, didn't realise the, uh, these things stayed. Could be done when it turned that way. We want to go. Oh, they didn't. They didn't stay on this end. That's interesting. They didn't stay here, but they, yeah. So, okay. So, how do we do this? How do we do this? Like this. So, um, we come here. We grab ourselves a transport pipe. I'm gonna go up five. come back to like here somewhere wherever and dirt is our first one so dirt needs to come up as low as it can possibly come which is i think there yep connect to there and then copper uh, sorry iron will come up one above it and we'll sit there should just be there. Okay. No. Oop. Thought I'll put a random one in somewhere. It is really weird dragging these up because sometimes they go up the way you want them to, other times they don't. They go along instead of up. It's kind of the angle you're looking at with them. So yeah, um, yeah. So that's that's what we're gonna do for each and every one of them. So the next one,
We'll come up to here. We'll come along uh, to there. And then we'll uh, have to be kind of the exception to the rule. We'll have to do that. Hold on. Yep. Like that. And then it's going to be above it. And it's going to be above it. So we'll have up to 10 up high here. So, and then that will start all these going again. But we'll have to uh, get this running um, and test how many things actually come down the lines and start filling in here. And then we'll have to configure the outputs to have many, have, have many get in here before this... Um, disables it if that makes sense so so like dirt will be a certain amount and it'll be stored in here and we want to make sure that the amount that comes into here like the buffer the pipe length we have to make sure that this accounts for the pipe length so but we will do that next episode i'm going to connect all these up here and we will come back next time and we will continue from there so thank you very much for watching everybody i hope you have enjoyed this one hope to see you again next one and until then as always have fun <laughs>